So today's video is gonna be a barbecue review video and we are gonna be reviewing the Beef Eater 1600S series barbecue. If you are in the market and looking for a barbecue, whether that be a built-in barbecue or a trolley, this is the video for you. So as I mentioned before, this is the Beef Eater 1600 S series barbecue. Now this barbecue came out in 2022. So it's one of the, the newest model barbecues that Beef Eater have brought out. This is available in two different models. You've got the 1600 S, which this one is, and the 1600 E. The difference between the two is that the stainless steel, the, the 1600 S, everything is stainless steel. It's got cast aluminium end caps here, and it has a, a dark stainless steel section along here. Everything along here is stainless steel as well. The brackets are also stainless steel. With the 1600E version, this whole section down here is the dark stainless steel. The knobs and everything are still, um, are still stainless steel, but the, the, the E section has this it looks almost like a graphite colour and it actually looks really, really cool and very contemporary. They are available, both options are available in three, four and five burners and they are available in the built-in version and also a trolley version. The trolley version comes with um, cupboards underneath and also a side burner as well. An option if you're building in and it's not 100% necessary is you can get these stainless steel brackets. Now what they do is your worktops will come along like this, drop down and go like that, and these brackets will slide over the worktop so that your barbecue is hanging from the worktop and it's not sat on a shelf here. You can, if you want to, not have the brackets and it is able to just sit on a surface down there if that's what you want to do. It might be worth mentioning also that the 1600 series will fit into um, this outdoor kitchen as well. This is the Beefy to Harmony or signature sometimes it's called. This is their outdoor kitchen. Both the four and the five burner versions will fit into um, different variations of this kitchen. This is a really cool kitchen and it works really well with this barbecue. It'll also fit well into the Fresco Pro kitchen, which is this one that we've got over here. Um, so yeah, pretty much any of the Beef Eater outdoor kitchens, the 1600 series uh, will fit into. So looking at the outside here, this is called a low lie lid, uh, low lie hood, uh, which looks really sleek. It looks really contemporary. It's really like Kirby. I really, really like it. Um, it's made of 304 stainless steel. You've got the thermometer on there. You've got the beefy to logo on there. It comes with a five year warranty as well, and it's available. So this, they come set up ready for propane LPG gas, but you can buy a conversion kit. So if you want to connect it to your mains gas, you're able to do that as well. So this is the four burner version. And down here, you've got the four um, laser etch burners there. They're big, they're bold, they're really, really sexy. Um, it's got the quartz ignition, same as on the other beefy to barbecue. So to light it, you push, turn, you can hear it click, that will ignite it and that's, and then you leave it and that's how you light your burners. So let's take a look under the hood. Oh, it's worth mentioning, you've got a viewing window there as well. So you can keep an eye on your food while you're cooking without lifting the hood. Um, Okay, so inside we've got a warming rack here, which is removable. You can take that in and out if you want to. It's got the slots here for the rotisserie, so you can get rotisseries for these, really good for doing chickens and pulled pork and lamb and things like that. You've got your cast iron grids here, so you've got a, an open grill here. Um, so you, lots really big, so that's about 400 mil, I'd say, in total 800 mil wide. Um, by about 600 mil deep. So you've got lots and lots of space there to cook on. That's really heavy, it's really good quality. Um, underneath that open grid there, if you want to come and have a look, you've got some stainless steel vaporizers here. Now what they do is when any fat that comes through, they will stop those from going onto the burners. You only have those underneath the open grill. This plate doesn't need it obviously because the, the fat can't get through. 
you've got a solid plate here, like a teppanyaki plate for cooking onions, prawns, things like that. On the other side, you've got uh, the same thing again, but you've got that grid system there. If you were doing a steak maybe and you wanted to get a nice sear marks on there. Um, underneath the, the grills there, like I mentioned before, you've got these vaporizers. And then here in the, your main cooking section, you've got these four kilowatt um, cast iron burners, and that's gonna provide all of the heat for cooking your food. So there you go, like a really, really um, sexy grill. I really like the way this looks. It's really good, it's very well made. You're gonna feed lots of people with it. It's available in different options, different sizes. So all in all, if you're looking for a built-in barbecue or a trolley version, this is a really good one to have a look at. And it's really well priced as well compared to a lot of the other barbecues that are on the market. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you want to see more videos like this, um, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the alert notification and then you'll get notified every time we bring out a new video. We also have Facebook, we have Instagram, so if you want to see what we're currently up to with our kitchens that we do, which is what we do the most, um, then head over there and give us a follow. So thanks very much for watching this video and we'll see you on the next one.